Trees are part of our subtropical landscape, so much so that we often take them for granted. But a deadly disease is infecting a palm tree commonly seen across South Florida and could possibly spread to other palm trees. Betty Davis looks at the extent of the threat and how scientists are trying to stop it. Cabbage palms are a part of the native landscape of the southeastern United States, standing tall as the official state tree for both Florida and South Carolina. Because it's a native species, the cabbage palm is important from both an ecological and environmental perspective. The fruits of the trees serve as an important food source for native wildlife, and some species of birds will nest in the canopy. But cabbage palms across South Florida are dying from a disease called lethal bronzing. This disease is caused by a type of bacteria that can only survive in a plant or uh, insect host, sort of like a virus. The bacteria is introduced into the trees by an insect that feeds on the leaves of cabbage palms. And the bacteria is present in the saliva of this bug and it gets injected into the palm and over time it becomes, uh, it moves throughout the entire plant and eventually uh, causes uh, symptoms and eventual death of, of the palm itself. At the University of Florida's Institute of Food and Agricultural Services in Davie, researchers are attacking the problem from multiple angles. Infected trees are removed, then nearby healthy trees can be injected with an antibiotic. This is an antibiotic that in becomes systemic or fully distributed in the plant and that helps to prevent new infections. Scientists also are trying to identify the insect responsible for transmitting the disease. Once we know what bug is transmitting it, we can then uh, develop more efficient management programs that target uh, the insect itself. Cabbage palms are not the only trees affected by the plant hopping insect that's spreading lethal bronzing. Highly valued date palms also are being wow. infected. And how many times have you walked past or driven past these palms, not giving them a second thought, and some of them are in trouble. Well, they're what makes South Florida so great. And they haven't been able to find out what insect is doing the damage. And huh? where it's coming from, too. And that's why this research is so important. Wow. Good mm -hmm. report, Betty. Thank you.